Hello ladies, gentlemen, hermaphrodites and glorious drag queens. This is take five, so my advice would be to use the first take. Anyway, good morning, welcome from the Salon Live. My name is Jan Timms, your host with a nice cup of herbal verbal. The mirror lies. Notice how it spies on you from every angle in the room when you don't ask it to. The mirror lies as it spies and tries to avoid your eyes, then it lies about your size and ignores what's deeper inside. The mirror lies and it takes us for a ride until we despise what's on the outside and ignore what's beautiful on the inside. The mirror lies and destroys your pride as you get a bit older and decide you look snide from the side because of those happy lines near your mouth from your smile. Do you ever look in the mirror and wonder what they see? Truth lies about me. We may ask mirror mirror on the wall, oh why why aren't I taller, smaller, thinner, fatter, richer, poorer? No richer, 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 or something like that. On and on and on we drone, as if we are clones. The mirror lies and takes you for a ride. It lies about your size, and then you want to hide. Extend your lovely character and live for all to see. Be your unique self that you were born to be. Now is the time to truly set yourself free. Expand your unique self, wear that thing that feels good next to your skin, wear that thing that only you feel you look good in. Next time you look in the mirror, gently be, look into your eyes and see what's deeper. More than skin deep, your soul, your whole. Gently be, breathe and see your reflection in the clear gift water mirror. And be amazed at the sheer ingenuity of the invention of your unique self of the human body and the invention of the mirror. Thank you. That's the poem for the day. So thank you everyone. Have a lovely day and be your unique self. Ciao for now.